Well, we are seconds away from uh, kick-off here. The captains and mascots just taking care of formalities. You can see uh, United on the front foot already. Flood fires it in all the way through to Luke Lee. And already, Stuart, Dundee United trying to hit us with a bit of tempo. Yeah, I think, well, you mentioned it about the, the sun. I think that's been the problem there as Falkirk on the counter-attack through Lee Miller and then plays it wide to Craigan. Far side, overlapping him is Aram Muirhead instead he crosses it in. Cross in. Oh, oh clip the goalkeeper. But referee says foul. Nathan Austin going in with Cammy Bell. Nathan Austin as Aram Muirhead decides to get the long one in in towards the penalty box looking for Lee Miller head of the way though by Dundee United only as far though as Craig James Craig and a shot oh just past the post for James you can see though United I have to say going forward Stuart they look really lively with that uh, attacking trio not overly convincing in defence though at the moment no it's what we need to try and get ball on ground as United pick the ball up again in decision in midfield Murray against Gaspar Otto, 18 yards out as a shot and no, oh, just past the post but yeah at the moment it's Dundee United who are getting all the pressure, nice header where Simon Murray just peels off Adam Muirhead again 20 yards out as a shot, deflects off Gaspar Otto to Andrew should have done better but Falkirk really just have to relieve the pressure and they're getting the flick ons as Murray soon one one and scores for Dundee United. 15 minutes gone in the first half and it was effectively route one football. Long kick out from the goalkeeper flicked on by Mickelson and then 15 yards out Simon Murray puts the ball in the back of the net. Ways to Adam Muirhead puts him under a little bit of pressure but thankfully gets a, the ball back with a little bit of space. Again he's looking for a Falkirk man plays a 1-2 with Craig Sibbald. Falkirk though just going forward slowly but surely. Ball goes forward to Luke Leahy. Crosses the ball in, flat cross. Dunnan just clears away only as far as Mark Kerr. 30 yards out. Sideways to Joe McKee. James Craigan was looking for the crossfield ball. Instead cross to Mara Muirhead. It's a handball. Managed to win the ball. Mark Kerr, well done Mark. Sibbled. Luke Leahy in the penalty box. Crosses in. And oh nobody there for Falkirk. Robson in the left back position now comes up towards halfway looks for an option finds Kuati tackled by Sibbald he's taking the ball off him plays it forward to Austin needs to hold off edge and Gilly though which he does well back to McKee chance to cross ball in's a good one yeah! and that's a stunning goal from Falkirk James Cregan with the acrobatic scissor kick fires it into the top corner and the Bears are level. You have to say, as soon as the chance there in the interception, I thought it was just curling away. But great technique from Cregan. An absolute peach of a goal. Oh, it's absolute beauty from James Cregan. As we know, Lewis, James Cregan doesn't do six yard tap ins. <laughs> it was an absolute cracker from James Cregan. And a great cross as well. That's the thing we've been talking about. All the, all the time is good delivery from Falker. Goes towards the back stick, looks for Gasparotto, wins a header, creeping in and just a yard off the line, it's diverted wide of the post. Again, flights it towards the back post, Peter Grant wins a knockdown and Muirhead and Miller and then Cammy Bell dives out from his goal. Falkirk flight the free kick in, goes to the back post and then the ball ultimately held by Cammy Bell, Falkirk fans feeling that there was a foul there at the back post but again Mickelson winning the ball, Spittle, he's changed wings cross comes in to Murray, oh nice block from Gaspar Otto and Luke Leahy too, looks in a bit of bother but Falkirk go on the counter attack, Nathan Austin collects the ball gets booze from Dundee United fans, don't know why he got elbowed in the face for me junks inside it, Aiton Gooley to James Cregan as a shot, oh it's saved by the goalkeeper corner kick, Falkirk well, good save by Bell just to push that one wide of the post. Corner kick goes to the back post again. Gasparotto with the header. The scramble. And Cami Bell at the second time of asking. Currently neck and neck as we uh, have three minutes of the first half to play. Plus 
the injury time for Stuart Murdoch as Austin flicks it on. Miller chips it back and the shot from Cregan. Just a yard and a half wide of Cammy Bell's left hand post. And United suddenly find Murray. They have a chance to break here in numbers. They've got a four on three. Dylan bursts forward. The cross in. Headed away well. United still have it though. You have to say good defending. And obviously hoping that the cheers will do that as Simon Murray picks the ball up. 18 yard, heads in the backs of the box, he plays it wide. Spittle has a shot, and it's a goal for Dundee United! Simon Murray played the ball sideways to Spittle. 17 yards out, and I've got to say, another cracking strike. Dylan looking for a man, looks for Andrew in the penalty box. Cross in, no, the flood, cross it in, cleared away though by Peter Grant, easy peasy for the big Falkirk centre half. Nathan Austin manages to get the ball, second time. And he goes forward and then fouled. Takes the run up, flights it in, goalward, it's in! It's a stunning strike from Joe McKee, 25 yards out. Rockets its way into the back of the net. Looking at the replay. Steps up. Nope, no deflection. Just right into the top corner. Oh, Cammy ab- Bell, pick it out. Yeah, pick it out, Cammy Bell. He got beat all, all days up. He thought it was going to be a cross into the, the centre halves. Joe McKee thought otherwise. An absolute cracking strike from Joe McKee. Falkirk back in the game, 18 yards out. See the replay there. Good work by John Baird, though, wins it back for his side. He needs support, instantly looking for options. And it's Mark Kerr who provides the out ball. And then immediately cross field to Muirhead. Muirhead with three men in front of him. Opts to go wide to Cregan. Cregan flights it in. The header from Baird. Yeah! And it's in! John Baird, the substitute, heads Falkirk into the lead. And the flag, though, has gone up. Bobby Madden is calling it back. Look at the replay. A clean header. Bobby Madden says no goal. Well, confusion goes round everyone in the press box. Right out on the touchline, 20 yards out. Back to Spittle. Plays it forward, looking for Andrew. Andrew. Whips the cross in, looking for Mickelson. The header's a good one, it's going in. Oh, and that's save. a great save by Robbie Thompson. Absolutely brilliant save by the Falkirk keeper. To stop Falkirk going, a goal behind. Huge moment and a great save by Robbie Thompson. Throwing himself to his left-hand side. Getting a hand on that. Meanwhile, Falkirk break the length of the pitch. Cregan finds Muirhead, takes a touch. The shot deflects. Thankfully... Just wide of the post. Falkirk have to settle for a corner. The game going end to end. Falkirk launch it in. Headed away by Andrew. And right enough, there is the full-time whistle. So, uh, you have to say an entertaining game. One that Falkirk were potentially not un- uh, unlucky not to come away with the win. But... On this occasion, the uh, the linesman's flag denying them a third goal. But you have to say, equally sure, at the opposite end, a great save by Robbie Thompson at the end. So, potentially, the draw, a fair result.